Hi guys, it's Shade and welcome back to my channel. And if you're new, welcome to the channel. And today, you guys, well, tonight I should say, the time now is, can you see that? 12.28 a.m. And y'all, I'm actually about to record another video and I'm, I started doing my makeup and I was like, let me just whip out my camera now, have a little chit chat with y'all, you know, catch up with you guys, see how y'all doing. As y'all can see, I already did my eyebrows. It's not about to be nothing extravagant. Cause I ain't going nowhere. I just want to look, you know, a little cute. Every now and then you just want to get a little cute. So yeah, let's go ahead and catch up. Yeah guys, so how have you guys been? Everyone is still on lockdown. I am based in the UK if you guys didn't know. Um, yeah, we still locked down, it ain't nothing new. Going crazy inside the house as usual. Um, I was thinking of like hot topics. And the reason that I was thinking about it is because I was scrolling down on the shade room, y'all. And <laughs> I knew that 6ix9ine was out. I don't know if y'all know who 6ix9ine is, but he is a rapper and he went to jail for I don't I think it's a whole I think it was quite a few things to be honest with y'all. Um drugs, kidnapping, a whole lot of things. And apparently, not even apparently he did. He snitched on his crew. But she says it's not really his crew. He said that they didn't really, you know, treat him well and they didn't respect him and they, you know, harmed him and things like that. So, you know, everybody thought he was done out here. I'm not even going to lie. I thought, I thought so too because I'm 29. So, you know, when you, you kind of grow up with, you know, once you snitch, it's over for you. But honestly, y'all, in today's time, once you have a, you know, support, and a following you can't you can't be canceled you can't be done you will always be around because you'll always have those persons looking you know looking for you and wanting to hear from you and things like that so yeah y'all that was that was funny to me like i was scrolling and he got two million views on his live y'all two million views like <laughs> i can't even believe that but yeah so Today it just shows that there's no cancel there's no cancel culture. You can't cancel anyone. Once you have some type of support, some type of following, you set. And that's just sadly, that's just how it is. No matter what you do, you'll always have supporters. And that's just how it is now. So yeah. Right? That was just a that was something that I found pretty funny. I always wanted to share it with my always go in the comments and I laugh and stuff like that. But yeah, so you know, some of the people were saying, oh, well, he can't even go out in New York, which may be true, but then it's like it all worked out in perfect timing for him because you can't really go out now anyway. So ain't he lucky <laughs> by the time he they actually go out, he'll be fine. So and it looks like he still has money. Everybody thought he would have been broke as well, but oh, he's, he's doing just fine from what I see. But then we never know what's going on behind closed doors, but. From what he's showing, it seems like he's all right. So I'm just looking over here. I have another mirror over here. I'm just gonna put on my foundation. Okay. And what I'm using right now, this is my actually my favorite drugstore. If you haven't watched any of my Get Ready With Me before, this is the Maybelline Fit Me Matte, and I use the color 360. So, yeah. But yeah, guys, um, I'm trying to think what else has been going on in my personal life. Uh, <laughs> yo, with this lockdown, right? I, I'm so bored. I, you know, I said, you know, maybe I should try <laughs> see if I could sort something out with my dating life, right? Because it's non-existent. So I went and downloaded Hinge because apparently Hinge is set up to be deleted. So, you know, it's supposed to be like a, a for sure thing. So they say. And you guys, I'm starting to think that all of these dating apps are the same. Low key, the same thing. Like, people go on these sites saying that, or these apps, I should say, they go on these apps saying, oh yeah, I want a serious relationship. Some are, I'm not even going to bash that, but you got some, some weirdos out here. Like, <laughs> I started talking to this guy, right? Well, we, we matched or whatever. We matched. And... He was like, okay, yeah, can we talk outside of um of the app? I said, yeah, cool, no problem. So he took my number. 
and he um he started messaging me so he was messaging on whatsapp and then he was like oh um can i facetime you i said yeah cool no problem of course like i know he wants to see how i look if i really look like how i look in the pictures and you know i want to see how he looks because he looked he looked really nice in the pictures so you know uh he calls me we facetime and Yeah, <laughs> he wasn't ugly, but I'm just gonna say, like, you know, as women, how we hit them angles. He was hitting them angles in the pictures because he looked so handsome. And y'all, it's not about looks, it's definitely not. But I was just like, <laughs> but yeah, he just he just came off weird from the start, like, just the things he was saying. Yeah, so just we started talking, right? He's like, oh, you're beautiful. Okay, yeah, thank you, you know. Nothing like a nice compliment. And then he goes to say, yo, he was African. <laughs> He's African. Like, I'm, I've am i never dealt with an African in my life. Never, you know, I have like, African friends. But, you know, he's Ghanaian or whatever. And he's like, oh, I'm going to take you to Ghana. For what? For why? You don't know me, sir. And he's like, oh, you're so beautiful. Yeah, thank you. Oh, I love your lips. <laughs> yeah, I think, <laughs> I think like when dudes say that, that annoys me so much. If we, you know, we dealing with each other on that level, you could say those type of things to me. But you just see my face. We just started talking. Like, don't, 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 please, please. So I was already a little turned off and then like, we will continue to talk. And it's like, I would try and steer the conversation back to like, you know, getting to know each other, and then he would continue to drift off into some weirdness. So I just was like, oh, "Okay, you know what? I'm I'm tired. I'm about to go to bed." But it was nice. <laughs> it was nice speaking to you. And then the next day, I was kind of busy because I was doing stuff with my family, and like I was talking to him, but like texting him, but it wasn't nothing serious. And then that evening, he's like, "Hi, I can't help but to feel like you're ignoring me." I said, all right, you know what? <laughs> you got to get blocked. <laughs> like, sir, we just started talking. And then on top of that, I don't think I mentioned it. He kept asking, like, oh, you ready to be with me? Are you ready to be with me? You can delete the app now because we're going to be together. I'm like, y'all, he just was not the one. He was not the one. So, I don't know if y'all can see, but I went ahead and I gel down, well, I tried to gel down my edges. And... So it's a little lighter here because that's the gel <laughs> and the makeup, you know, caked up on it. So, but anyways, like I said, I'm not going anywhere, so I don't have to be 100%. So, yeah, guys, I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to continue with him. Like, there are other guys on there, but I, I, I can't deal with the weirdness and I get turned off super easy. Like, you say something wrong to me. It's a wrap. Like, if we just start talking and we supposed to begin to know each other, don't be asking me nothing weird. Like, especially, like, in regards to my looks or, you know, sexually, that's such a turn off. That is such a turn off. I can't stand it. So, yeah. Uh, I may continue to try it, but I'm not 100% sure. <laughs> we'll see how it goes. Alright guys, so I went ahead and put my lashes on off camera and where did I leave off? Yeah. Dating. Y'all, dating is so hard. Especially these days, like I mean everybody's about majority of like, the time is like one thing. But yeah, so I was trying something different. <laughs> like I said, I'll continue. What do y'all think? What do y'all think about online dating or dating apps? Tell me how y'all feel about that. I, like I said, I, I try, I have tried before, I'm not even going to lie, but they just don't seem to work for me, so, <laughs> I, I don't know, I don't know, I guess, you know, everything comes in time, so, I guess it's just not my time right now, but, 
yeah I'm just gonna go ahead and blend this in okay so I'm gonna go ahead and blend this in now um so other than my tragic <laughs> love life how is everything going for everyone how is y'all how are you guys finding um if you're single how are you finding dating just let me know i know it's gonna be like super hard especially during this time where no one can really get out but i i don't know why i thought it would just be like a little easier since everyone is kind of you know locked inside but personally i don't feel like it changed much to anything so yeah, tell me how, what do you guys think? How do you guys feel about it? So, yeah. All right, so I'm just gonna go ahead and finish this off really quick. Like I said, this is just like a quick makeup look just so I can record my other video. But y'all, I really enjoy talking with you guys, but I don't think y'all like me talking so much because my chit chat videos don't do too well, but I'ma still keep doing them for those who do, who do like them, so yeah. Alright, so I'm just going to go ahead and finish this off with some lip gloss, nothing special. Let's go ahead and do that. No lip liner or anything, just lip gloss. Alright, so, yeah. Alright y'all, so I went ahead and put these little baby hoops in my ears, as you guys can see. Just give myself a little finished look, you know, so I'm, I look pretty cleaned up now. A little light, you know, a little light beat, nothing special, nothing special. I'm not going nowhere. Where am I going? Where am I going? Nowhere. So, yeah, I just want to thank you guys for tuning in. Um, That little, that little chit chat we had. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed it. I know this video isn't going to be too long, but... You know, like I said, just wanted to come in and check on you guys. Um, give you guys a little update of myself, of what I have been doing to let the time pass by. I haven't had any luck, but you know, like I said, I'll still give it a try. But yeah, we'll see how it goes. If I get, if it gets any better for me, I will give you guys a further update. But yeah, so I'm about to go ahead and um, record my next video and the actual video that I'm supposed to be recording. And yeah, guys, remember to stay safe, uh, stay indoors, you guys, protect yourself, protect your families, and um, remember to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, you guys, bye!